Open Lovable, open source version of lovable.dev and the code is available for free on github.com and it's currently trending right now. I was able to clone this website and here's the clone and it's currently running on my local computer. Similarly, you can easily clone a website, modify the application and build from there. And I'm going to take you through step by step how you can install this, run it like this and able to build the application. That's exactly what we're going to see today. Let's get started. First, I'm going to show you how you can install this. So oh, go to GitHub, open Lovable. There we got detailed step. So first, git clone, open Lovable URL and then click enter. Next, navigate to the open Lovable folder. Next, as a prerequisite, you need npm installed on your computer. So go to nodejs.org and you can download npm from there. So now continuing with this, just type npm install to install the application. Now I'm going to open this in a code editor. So here is the list of files and you got .env.example. So the key API key required is E2B API key used for sandbox and file crawl to crawl the website and other providers such as model providers such as Anthropic, OpenAI, Gemini, Grok. So you need to generate the API key and paste it here and rename this as .env instead of .example. So that's it. But sometimes if you don't prefer changing this file, there's an alternate option. So go back to your terminal. There export your Anthropic API key like this and then click enter. Export your Firecrawl API key like this and then click enter. Export E2B API key like this and then click enter. So these three are the key requirements. So instead of Anthropic, you can also use OpenAI or other models. Now next, we need to do npm run dev to run the application. That is the final step. And I'm going to click enter and you can see the application is currently running in this URL. So I'm going to open this URL and this is how it looks. So I just need to enter the URL and based on that, it's going to generate me the application. So I'm going to use Sonnet4 because I provide an Anthropic API key and you can also use template to start. Also, I'm going to clone this Firecrawl website. So just copying the URL, firecrawl.dev and I'm going to keep other option as the same. Choose Sonnet4 and then click enter. Now it will automatically create your sandbox. That is a dedicated system or let's say a computer that's why it's trying to generate the code and run the code so that it doesn't disturb other application now you can see it's automatically cloning the website and then analyzing the code and trying to create the whole application from and you can explore all the list of files here and it's fast as well now i can see that all these files got created and when i preview that this is what it looks like and here it says successfully created the website so what i'm going to do is I'm going to copy this message and then here or type here. Also going to copy this error message and paste that here and click enter. Now it's fixing the error. Again, it comes up with this error. So just copying the error message and pasting it here. It would have been better if this system can automatically identify these errors, console errors, and then fix itself. And here is the final output, the website with the correct data copied across. I can see all these functions are working and then it clearly explains the example content from the website, testimonials, the pricing, and FAQ. And here's the footer. You can see all the list of files which got created here. So we can also download these files. So I'm going to download that. Now it got downloaded, I can open it. So here are the three different steps to run this application locally, which got just generated. So unzip the file, run npm install, and then npm run dev. And here you can open. So these are the exact step which we did before to run this open lovable. So again, we are going to do the same. This is just to show you that you can download the file and run it yourself. So here I'm unzipping, it's done. It's my downloads folder and inside downloads, CD E2B project number three. That's the latest folder. Then I can just type npm install and npm run dev, that's it. Now I can open this URL. You can see that it's running in this local host and here is the website that is just copied across and this is like an application running locally on your computer. So you can modify this based on your requirement. And let's compare that with Firecrawl. Here's the real Firecrawl website. And it's trying to create similar to this, but not 100% accurate. That could be because of the model which we are trying to use. We could even try using other models such as GPT-5 or Cloud Opus. So for now, I'm really impressed with this. And the things to note is that it doesn't have a prompt box. It has a URL box. So it's just mostly copying other websites. And also currently, 
these four models are supported. I believe probably in the near future, more models will be supported. And it is quite clean as well. So I wouldn't say it's 100% exactly as lovable, but it's getting there. Do try and let me know in the comments below what you think about this. Considering you already like lovable, I also created another video, which I'll put the link in here. It's about the real lovable, which I highly recommend for you to watch, and I will see you there.